Hi, welcome to one of my practice sessions. Uh, now I'm gonna be working on throwing the ball faster than normal, being a little versatile with it. So not just firing away, but changing it up a little bit. But we'll start at the uh, high end of the spectrum. That's pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, maybe I should actually turn on Spectro so I can get, so I actually can uh, can get a read. All right. While well, that's loading, I'll throw another one. It's not very often I get to throw it fast anymore, but um, oh, so looks like Spicto might be down right now. Yeah, Spicto is down right now, but that that's definitely firm. Try to see if I can catch it a little bit more. That's probably about as hard. I can throw it harder, but it's probably as hard as I'm ever gonna get to get to actually throw it. So let's back up. Take it down a little bit. Again, I'm practicing throwing it faster, not just fast. So faster than my normal speed, but not just like humming it down there. Two out of three. And I'll tell you, with my normal speed, this reality looks pretty bad here. It's just way too early. But with this higher speed, it's actually all right. The advantages of throwing it fast. You have a great good ball motion though, and most of the time I can't throw it that fast and create good ball motion, so it is what it is. But still practice it. Alright, so move a little further right. Get the speed up a little higher. Too firm. Basically, I'm just kind of setting my feet in, in a random spot and trying to uh, match my say, say my feet in a random spot and trying to match my speed. So. Closer. Good little tip if you're practicing, like, you don't just try to throw it at one speed. Try to move around and, all right, I, if I put my feet here, all right, if we're at that speed, then slide, all right, then gotta slow down a little bit. All right, now it's high, so we gotta like 
tweak it, tweak it to make it perfect. And really learn to do that. Ah, oh. that was firm, right, bad. And even with this much speed, you can see the reality is picking up too soon, just kind of rolling out. Jesus. All right. We can do better than that. That's, that's why I want to practice throwing it hard because my tendency if I get rusty with throwing it hard is over throwing it with my arm. So, which is what happened in the last two shots here. So let's try not doing that. That's much closer, much better shot. See if we can get one that strikes here. All right, so I'm gonna make a whole move again here. Try something different. That's more of the, uh, that there's more of the, I threw at my normal speed and I four pin, so now I gotta throw just a pinch faster to get the four pin out. That was, that was probably that speed there, which is a really important speed to be good at. Fast, but not very close. So let's see, that was, that was a four pin. So let's see if I can micro adjust and get away from the four pin here. Well, missed right. Still think speed was a pinch firmer there. So it's one of the hard things like when you're throwing it faster it can be a little more difficult to um, to be accurate. At least I feel like it because you're everything's going quicker and it's it's easier to kind of get out of timing a little bit. That was pretty good. That was pretty close to where I left the four seven. Um, direction wise and just a little firmer to keep it online. Alright. Um, 
Let's get another of the really firm ones in here. Was really firm, really bad. Let's get one that's a little bit better. I'm actually gonna call it now. I'm gonna messenger this one. I'm gonna messenger this one. Closer to an 810 than a messenger. That's probably about as firm as I can throw it, and that almost never comes into play. So let's slow it down a little bit. Also, to have a little more ball reaction. rolls out and stops there. All right, last one. Because it, it has to be usable. Don't really feel like that there is very usable, so. It's a combination of firm more hand and a little more uh, launch angle. That one there is, that's probably a little more technically sound and a little more usable in the long run. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed watching me practice. Uh, practice throwing it fast today. Uh, make sure you check out more videos, playlist, uh, everything here on the channel. I have a bunch of practice sessions videos where you can see how our pro practices. So thanks for watching.